What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Kill back with another video, man. You already know what's going on. Uh, we're gonna get into a little short tutorial on some automation and some side chain compression. Basically, I'm side chaining uh, some delays to cut them off every time the main vocal comes back in so they don't get in the way. So I'm gonna just play what this sounds like so y'all can hear it real quick. What it is is what it is. Yeah, living like the rich and wealthy. Bad bitch, quota. Oh yeah, hold up. Don't drink soda. As fat, sorta. Turn up, burn up. Lightweight, threw up. Okay, so what? Get dressed, close up. All right, so this is a song that I mixed for an artist named Suave. Worked with him a lot. Done like probably like 30, 40 songs for him. Um, so basically. All I did here was I went to my bus, like if you want to route this yourself, you would create a new bus. So I just select a bus that's not used, so bus 10. And then I would put my delay, which would be the repeater from Slate Digital. Boom, so I put that, get that how I want it. And then I will put my uh, R compressor. And uh, I'll show you guys the settings on it in a second, but basically I'm gonna show you how you would go to automate it. So that same, Aux 10, bus 10, we just set up. We're gonna go on the leads track right here. We're gonna click this, we're gonna hit main, and then we're gonna look for it. So it's the Aux 10, we're gonna hit absolute. So now we got full control over this delay right here. So if I just crank it up and exaggerate it just so y'all can hear, you'll see we're controlling it. Surfing, she riding the wave, she coming late. Hungry, I fix her a plate. Salty, she has her own taste. What a disgrace. Turn up, turn up, burn up, burn up. Lightweight, lightweight, threw up. Okay. So what? Uh, get dressed, dress, close up, close up, getting sloppy, getting sloppy. All right, so you see it's mad simple. So you can automate it anywhere. So you can just put a delay anywhere in the song, or if you want to do the same thing for reverb, or even if you wanted to do this for like distortion, or like uh, just any type of crazy effect. If you wanted to filter just like one part of your voice, you can do it just like that. Um, just make sure you got those plugins on there and you feeding it to the vocal. All right, so we're not actually gonna use this track. We're actually gonna go back to the one I did. And uh, these are my settings for the delay. I had uh, one eighth on the uh, timing. I spread it uh, to A right here. And middle on the feedback. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Volume was a little bit less than halfway. Um, so I'm gonna play it one more time. So we're gonna go back to this. So this is where I automated it. Had it at negative 6.7 dB, so not too loud, just very subtle, but still audible, so check it out one more time. Yeah, living like the rich and wealthy, bad bitch, bitch, quota, oh yeah, hold up, don't drink, soda, ass fat, sorta, turn up, burn up, lightweight, threw up, okay, so what, uh, good dress, close up. Alright, so basically... What the side chain compression is doing, and you could do this for anything. You could do this for instruments in a beat or a bass and kick if you feel like they clashing where basically the kick will kind of duck. You don't have to squash it. Cause the more you squash it, the more it's gonna turn it down. So if you want to just put it at zero, you just literally put the threshold all the way down, ratio all the way down, attack all the way down, and it'll basically just squash that delay. But I didn't want that. I wanted it to be audible, but just not in the way of the main vocal every time he came back in so it still sounded smooth. So what I did was I set up the side chain right here. So on the R compressor and a lot of other compressors too that have a side chain, you can just click right here and uh, look for your track, which was the bus nine leads, which is this track that's routed to all of these vocals right here. So that whenever the vocal would come in, the compressor knows to go ahead and turn down the delays. So if I squash it, this is what it'll sound like. Yeah, living like the rich and wealthy. Bad bitch, quota. Oh yeah, hold up. Don't drink soda. Ass fat, sorta. Turn up. So it's basically just letting it ring out only in that split second time or whatever he's not saying a word. You know what I'm saying? When the word comes back in, it's perfect. So he's not clashing. So this wasn't that bad, so I kept it at like negative 33 when I did this mix, so I'm gonna put it back there and let y'all hear that with the beat. Healthy. What it is is what it is, yeah. Living like the rich and wealthy. Bad bitch, quota. Oh yeah, hold up. Don't drink soda. Ass fat, sorta. Turn up, burn up. Lightweight, threw up. Okay, so what? Good dress, close up. All right, so it's that simple, you know? 
Um, another thing I'll show y'all real quick is how to make vocals sit a little bit better in the mix. And I actually had this disabled, but on the mix, this is what I used. Um, it's called the Sheps, I think, 73 or whatever. And uh, this plug-in right here, my bad, I just got a text. Um, this plug-in right here is uh, is great for just opening up a two-track beat. So if you don't have access to track outs or whatever, um, you just put this on here and you can kind of just mess with the beat without messing it up too much because it lets you just target different frequencies. So if you feel like the beat is really mid heavy, you can kind of dip the mids out. You feel like it's real low heavy, dip the lows out or whatever, or boost, vice versa. Um, but basically, I did very subtle um, EQ here. I just pulled a little, little bit of the mids out, like 0.6, like a little bit. And then uh, um, I took a little, little bit of the lows out. And that basically just gave the beat a little more space so that his vocal can sound a little better just sitting inside of it versus more so sounding like it's on top of the beat. So if I enable it, I'm going to uh, actually disable it, play it, and enable it while I'm playing it. Space, turn up, burn up, lightweight, threw up, okay, so what? Uh, now I know y'all can instantly hear that. Y'all can instantly hear how it brung up the vocal and just made the vocal sit way better with the mix. So I'm gonna turn it off on this part, turn it on again. Yeah, living like the rich and wealthy. Bad bitch, quota. Oh yeah, hold up. Don't drink soda. Ass fat, sorta. Turn up, burn up. Lightweight, threw up. Okay, so what? Good dress, close up. Very subtle, but it makes a big difference. Um, so that's pretty much it for this tutorial, y'all. I'm gonna wrap it up, man. Just some quick content for y'all. Definitely can catch another video tomorrow. I appreciate everybody that's been sending me mixes. Appreciate everybody that's been rocking with me. Yeah, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, like always, man. Leave a comment below if you got any questions or you got a video idea, anything like that, man. I'm out.